Hey, what's going on, beautiful, beautiful people? And you're looking at my beautiful face. How is everyone doing? Yes, it's another day. Yes, it is. In beautiful Salt Lake City, Utah. All right, so if you want to join the Mullet Club, please subscribe. I really would appreciate that. And if you could hit that little bell so that you get notified when my new videos go live. So this is day three of PSD training here in Salt Lake, and I am having an absolute blast. So what did I do today? Well, today I started out on the pad. I'm still working on my uh, pre-trip inspection, getting that down. And I think I'm doing a pretty good job at that, uh, just memorizing um, all the wording. That's really the biggest part. Um, I have kind of a mechanical background, so I know what the parts look like. It's just knowing the proper terminology that uh, Prime uh, needs to needs to hear. So I, I did that for like half the day, and then, uh, let's see. After lunch, then I went back on the simulator. <laughs> That was, that was a good time. Uh, only little small issue was I missed my first um, time on the simulation. So our instructor <laughs> had some fun with me. So he made me do two different scenarios back to back. The first one was just to kind of mess with me. So he made me go around in circles. And <laughs> the funniest thing, he had added this cow that passed me at like 70 miles an hour. And basically then he increased the wind and the ice and the snow until I failed. Just just giving me the lesson of please don't waste his time because then he's going to waste mine. And the second simulation was a pretty hard city driving um, uh, scenario. Um, lots of people walking out in front of you, um, having to stop behind school buses and making sure you don't take uh, routes that are uh, no trucks allowed and making sure that you're looking for signs for clearance and other things. So I, I had a pretty good day today. Now, as I, as I stated yesterday, uh, for the next few days, I'm just going to go over the exterior pre-trips just for practice for me. Now, I may make mistakes. So if I do make a mistake, please go ahead and let me know. I, I'd really like to hear that feedback. But today, I'm going to try and go over the driver's side, um, sorry, the driver's door. And I always like to put an and there, driver's door fuel area. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now and just jump right into it. So this is my inspection for the driver's side, <laughs> driver's door fuel area. Sorry about that, guys. I'm the, the wording there is still a little bit weird for me. But I'm going to go ahead and start with my mirrors. Properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and they are clean. Now my door and hinges, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, opens and closes and latches properly, and the seals are not worn, torn, or dry rotted. My fuel tank, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, not leaking from the tank and the cap, and the cap is on tight. My catwalk and steps, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and there are no loose objects. My frame and cross members, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. No unauthorized welds. And no cross members are missing. My exhaust system, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. And no signs of leaks. My drive shaft, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. Not twisted. And the U-joints are free of debris. My torque arm. Properly mounted, secured, not cracked. Move it back, move that back a little bit. Sorry about that, guys. My torque arm properly mounted on both, properly mounted and secured on both ends, not cracked, bent, or broken. Mo moving right along, I'm going to go into my suspension, which is going to be my uh, spring hangers properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent. I'll move that back again. I, see, that's the thing that trips me up, guys. Is is just saying on both ends, so. My spring hangers, properly mounted and secured on both ends, not cracked, bent, or broken. My spring arm, properly mounted and secured on both ends, not cracked, bent, or broken. My U-bolts, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and none are missing. My shock absorber, properly mounted and secured on both ends, not cracked, bent, or broken, and not leaking. My airbag, properly mounted and secured on both ends, 
Not cracked, bent, or broken. No abrasions, bulges, or cuts. It is not leaking air. And the mounting bolts, none of the mounting bolts are missing. Moving it right along. So my uh, brake hose, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent. Ooh, moving it back, moving back. My brake hose, properly secured on both ends. No abrasions, bulges, or cuts, and not leaking air. My brake chamber, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and not leaking air. My slack adjuster push rod, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. With the brakes released and pulled by hand, the push rod should not move more than one inch. My brake drum, properly mounted, secured, not cracked, bent, or broken. My brake linings, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, free of any oil or debris, and the friction material is not worn dangerously thin. My drive tires, properly mounted and secured, no abrasions, bulges, or cuts to the sidewalls or the tread. The tread depth is no less than two thirty seconds of an inch. And this is filled to the manufacturer's specifications. My rim, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, no unauthorized welds. My lug nuts, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, none are missing, no rust trails or powder residue, and no cracks around the bolt holes. My axle seal, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, filled in manufacturer specifications, not leaking, and none of the mounting bolts are missing. And my mud flap, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, bent, or broken, and this concludes my, my driver's door fuel area. So guys, I, I'm really learning. I think I did a better job, really. I'm learning every day. So tomorrow, you'll, you'll, you'll see an update from me. I'll continue to do these in practice, but tomorrow I'm actually going to get tested on um, the four exterior components. So the uh, engine compartment, the driver's door fuel area, the coupling, and the trailer. So tomorrow I'm probably going to go over the coupling with you guys uh, for practice, and then the next day I will do the trailer. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I have a question for you. Why don't you have a mullet yet? They're awesome, man. They're awesome. <laughs>